Hello friends. Maybe it happened to you a few times already that you would be walking through a forest or orchard. Looking on the ground full of fallen leaves and you would find a leaf where the greenery rotted off, the green part, there were just veins. A leaf that you can see through. But you never found a leaf. on the ground that was just perfectly, perfectly just rains. None of the green part remaining. Well, I would like to show you today how you can make such I made this one. It can be done from leaves of trees of many species, but best it works from ficus religiosa, from leaves of a ficus that has this kind of long narrow tip. It's called religiosa because according to religion, Buddhist religion, Buddha was enlightened after meditating many days under such tree in a bamboo forest. When the ficus religiosa leaves still contain the green part, the leaves look like this. The leaves look like this. Some are very old where the green part is so hardened that it's hard to get rid of it. And some are very young, where the veins are also vegetably. So what you want is to get the leaves that are in between, not too old, not too young. And the recipe how to naturally without of any chemicals get rid of the green part but not the veins so the leaf would look like this is as follows. You get a bunch of those leaves more than you need because you could be wrong in your estimate of what's the just right age and so some would decompose some of the veins and some would just leave this kind of spots plentiful attached that you can't get rid of so you get a little more and you put the leaves, you break the leaf off and you put the leaves in a bucket of water and let it stay. I won't tell you how many days because it varies for instance on temperature and the bacteria in the air and mold in the air and all that. The trick is that you leave it 
for so long that this part will start disconnecting. The part of a stem that's very close to leaf is more vegetable and would rot off. That's when you're gonna take the leaves out of the bucket and rub it. And the green part, no longer green, it'll be brown, would come out. And all you would have is beautiful skeleton of the leaf. A souvenir, souvenir. And that's all there is to it. You can rub it with the old toothbrush or have a latex gloves on. And um, in two, three weeks, it depends on weather, two, three weeks after cutting the leaves and put it, putting it in a bucket of water somewhere in a yard to wait, you would have this nice skeletal skeleton leaves. And that's all there is to it. If you want to try it, enjoy the fun. Goodbye, friends. Bye.